hello everyone in this video i am going to give you a brief overview about the alignment in adobe indesign so i am going to share you with uh, one or two tips that is very critical to the alignment of the text in the adobe indesign so without wasting any time let's jump onto the computer screen so as you can see that we have multiple columns right and if i want to make any content or additional text okay i have created an additional text and i want it to be aligned with the first column right so i have created a text box and place the text over it and when i will align it i will click on the new text i will click on the first column and another click on the first column and from here at the bottom i can click on the align horizontal center so what it was supposed to do it was supposed to align this text with that one but it has not made it aligned but the reason is that the width of the text boxes are not same if i keep the width of the text boxes same so you can see that when i have clicked on the align center it has not aligned its center in fact it has aligned at the left of the paragraph that was not my requirement so in that case what you need to do you basically have to select the paragraph to the align center right now your text is entirely in the center of the text box now if you click on the, both of these and additional click on the first paragraph and now you click on the horizontal align horizontal center so you can see now it has it is perfectly in the middle of the paragraph okay that was the requirement in the same way if you click on the align right it will align at the extreme right of the paragraph you will click on the align left so it will align with the in respect of the both the width of the text box okay okay now what let's remove it and deal with the shapes i have created a square box just for the understanding and let's suppose i want to make it align so in order to make it align with the paragraph you you simply have to adopt this method but what what if you want to align with the respect of page you want to make it in the middle so what you need to do you will select the object and from the align panel you will click you will click on the align horizontal center so you can see that nothing has happened if you want to keep it at the middle of the page what you have to do you will have to select align vertical center when you click on the align vertical center you can see that nothing has happened okay so why nothing has happened you have to make a small selection you can see this option align to selection basically it deals with the selection of two objects basically it needs a reference for which it it has to be aligned so when you click on it you will see multiple options so from here you just select align to page now you click on the horizontal line center you will see that it has been perfectly aligned at the center of the page horizontally and from here vertically it is perfectly in the middle of the page so that small selection was very much handy in aligning the object so in some scenarios you have to align your object or text in the middle of the spread so what you need to do in that case select align to spread from here so now you will click on the align horizontal center it will centralize your object in the middle of the spread basically combination of two pages will form a spread over in that in that case so in, in the same way you can keep it to the extreme right extreme left top and bottom so in this way you can align your text and objects in the adobe in the adobe indesign document